nothing wrong with being cheap. Anyone that tells you that it's not good to be cheap, they don't want to see you win. We don't want people like that in our lives. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you guys can see, your girl Sasha is back here with another video. As you guys can see from the title, today I'm here to save you some money. We're gonna save you some money on food. So let's not be the person watching this saying, oh, I'm responsible with money. I don't spend money, I manage my money well. But let's, let's calculate how much money we spend on food the entire week. I'm gonna be real with you. I'm gonna be real. I spend majority of my paycheck on food. I'm a snacker. I'm not gonna from a snacker. So if I'm not snacking, I'm not happy. So we're gonna we're gonna save some coins today. Let's add up mentally, add up how much money we use during the week. And it's just on food. It's not even paying bills. So if we break it down, let's 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 break it down. So good paycheck i worked my nice you know part-time hours this week and i'm making some money and i'm making my paycheck like woo woo we about to we about to spend this money we about to you know get the priorities of the way and spend this money so i got my rent paid i got my utilities paid i got my credit cards paid i got my phone bill paid yada 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 the balance is it's a nice balance i'm gonna be living my best life with this you know the rest of my this paycheck but after you're just like yes i'm about to press you know I'm gonna press you know pay for these clothes i'm gonna pop out with you know and realize that i gotta feed myself the adult life requires you to feed yourself so no more going home to mama like mom i'm hungry what's your money at you got paid two days ago but mama like i have things to pay for I got things to pay for. None of that. No more. No more. So today we're going to be saving you money. Two weeks of meal prepping. It's not really meal prepping because I'm not going to be making the food. But it's more so like pre-meal prepping. Like pre-pre-meal prepping. That makes sense. I don't know if it makes sense. But it's going to make sense. Today we're going to do the breakdown of financing. We're going to do the breakdown of ingredients. and All that good stuff. So we're going to do two weeks of meal prepping pre-meal prepping for the price of only $60. Can it be done? Yes, it can be done because I've done it. We're gonna save money on food so the rest of the money can go to something important like some new bundles. Don't worry, I'm not gonna talk about this, but we're gonna get you some new bundles today. But before we get into this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as you can see the buttons down below and it's just as red as this so don't forget to click don't forget to follow me on all my social media accounts so you guys can be updated and notified and you know part of this friendship we're gonna build together and all that good stuff so enough said let's get right into the video okay guys so let's start the key to success when it comes to budgeting money i would say would be staying organized so all you, all you need is a piece of paper and pen and your mind so let's start okay so usually when it comes to grocery shopping i like to keep it very organized so i I'm, I'm a little more strict myself, so therefore I subcategorize it into fruits, lunch, snacks, dinner, which I forget to add until the end, and extras. So I usually fill it in, usually go by what I like. This is all about working with what you have, what you like type of person you are and just modifying it to best suits you and I can't stress this enough this is a plan where it helps you best suit your lifestyle as you guys can see I like certain things and my lifestyle isn't the same as yours so as you can see breakfast is a little more lighter get ready and go because usually I work at 9 to 6 so therefore in the morning I'm usually rushing out of my house so therefore I need a quicker breakfast so that's why my breakfast isn't as filling isn't as time consuming and all that stuff so next we have dinner as you guys can see dinner it gets a little more creative and a little more fun where I feel like you guys do a little more of your research of what you have in your cabinets and certain things online as you guys can see I have certain 
main dishes, which helps me subcategory into certain ingredients. Extras is a category more so for like the seasonings of certain foods and extra stuff like cooking supplies and stuff. So I have certain things like peppers, onions, cooking oil, and all that good stuff. But this is also the hardest part because I would say you need to be extremely strict and dedicated to your budget and your list. The key to reaching this goal of a budget is to be very strict. So enforcing self-control can help you guys be a little more strict with yourself when entering the grocery store because we all know going into the grocery store self-control is probably the biggest the biggest issue also fun fact i think a lot of us do know do not go to the grocery store hungry because everything in sight looks beautiful so let's not do that have a snack or something or do it after dinner and all that stuff but make sure to stay dedicated to this 60 dollar budget or whatever budget you choose and success will will come yeah. Let me tell you guys how much work it is to carry your own grocery bags in Manhattan. Let me tell you guys, if you live in Manhattan, you know the classic Trader Joe's bags. You know. You know these brown bags and you know how heavy they get. But let me tell you something. Anyone tells you you need a man to help you carry your grocery bags, delete them. Delete. Them. All of mine are already deleted. The arms don't look like they do much, but they carry their own grocery bags. So, a small disclaimer that this routine isn't for everyone because everyone consumes a different amount. Everyone prefers to do their own grocery shopping. Everyone, you know, it depends on, you know, certain grocery stores. So the limit might be a little too small for you. It might be a little too big for you. But it's just for, you know, it's it's fun. So just you can modify it on your own, change it up. But I came here to show you guys proof on my receipt. Because many of you guys are like, no, Sasha, you probably tweaked it a little bit. Da 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 da. You probably, you're not showing us everything, how you do it. Girls magic. Let me let me succeed. Let me let me succeed in life. But I did go over two dollars. Um, but two dollars of me being happy because of my cookie butter. So let me be happy. But I went over sixty dollars. And some of you guys might be like, "What? How did you get go over sixty? You know, how did you get your groceries to sixty dollars?" This really isn't a plan for someone. These, this is a plan for someone who who wants to go off with what they have. So this is basically a pre pre meal prep, like pre pre meal prep. Of it's like not making the meals, but it's the stuff to make the meals and that's just as important as making the meals um, because it's financing and it just saves you a lot of money and it's just why not save so all this basically went off with what I already have so like I had some chicken left over from probably you know a meal prior or the chili I have certain things at home I can just make so therefore I didn't have to buy certain things like rice chicken I bought extra pasta but you know this like extra stuff so yeah, but if you're a type of person and you and you don't got you don't got much, you got like dust bunnies in your fridge, then we gonna do another video for you. But don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and subscribe, and subscribe. I just need a little like fading so you hear it echo and you don't really get that out of your head. Like, and subscribe. And subscribe to my channel so you guys get to know me and get to know you better and all that good stuff. But until next time, guys. Bye. Take man feed that stop chat. Jumping on my car, make me slap that a snapback. We are doing things, I you know, say me not.